Hello Marvel Strike Force fans, this is your friend, the Fast and Comic Guy here. And today I am going to do a tutorial on how to 3 star the Medical Supply Tier 11 run. But first I thought I would open up a few Mega Orbs that I have just to maybe we'll get lucky and we'll see some amazing like 180 Hella. Um, later I will be doing a Red Star opening one once I get up to 50 and I will be waiting for Black Bolt to be the higher chance in the for the drop rate. So down here as you can see I got two May Orbs. We open them up and I got... Wow. I was literally thinking about this five minutes before going my worst <laughs> pull ever was a Ant-Man and look what I got. Uh, that is just depressing. And so I got a whole bunch of ultimate shards. That's that's depressing. So uh, what is that? It, let's see. Ultimate shards, ultimate shards. That's a so yeah. I got a whole lot of ultimate shards. Let's see what that actually turns into for ultimate shards. I got one thousand eight hundred seventy-two ultimate shards. That's awesome. Uh okay. Well. I was also thinking of all. Let's see, what does he give me? More Ultimus shards. Awesome. So, yeah, today was a pretty big dud on the uh, orb openings. Uh, let's see, I'll just do a couple. Yeah, he's okay, I guess. It's not Ultimus shards, but again, I'm not really farming them. She's going to be Ultimus shards. I just haven't paid to upgrade her to seven. He's good. I actually could use his uh, shards. I can use his. Colson, I don't need him. I got lucky on him. I worked really hard during his milestone event, so I didn't really actually have to wait too long to get him to 7 star. Awesome. So that's all those guys. And I think actually, since it is St. Patty's Day reward stuff, let's see what do we got here. And, ooh, four hella, that's a plus. Lots of gold. Oh, I see, these aren't too bad. These aren't bad pulls. Okay, it ended on a, on a low note. <laughs> so that's a whole bunch of extra shards, basically. All right, so why don't we get on to it, and we will check out this, how to three-star the tier 11 in medical supplies so what I did for this was I used a lot of support and I had my uh, symbiote spider-man so we will start the event and I was about 277 K power I can't seem to touch the other ones though so uh, it does seem like it does make a difference some more uh, gear you get characters for uh, tier 14 because uh, basically everything before that so like going from like gear 12 to gear 13 is only like a 5% difference but apparently going from 13 to 14 in some cases can be a huge difference like up to 35k 35% uh, uh, difference in stats Oh, who would I? I think I went after Shiri first. I hate heal, so I always go after the healer first. Cause no matter what, if you have if they leave a healer up, the healer will always be uh, keeping people alive, basically, and that's the thing that I don't like. It. So once you get rid of their healer, then people basically you can chip away at them super slow, and that's when things get easy. So she's gone. I don't think I actually need to worry about him very much. Alright, now let's get rid of Deadpool. That wasn't very nice, him taunting. That just basically makes things a little bit longer. So the reason why I don't like the Deadpool one... Oh! Leave my uh, Scientist Supreme alone, buddy. She doesn't want any of your trouble. Uh, 
There we go. So, yeah, basically once it gets here, we got a whole bunch of people with taunting abilities. Uh, well, by a whole bunch, I'm including uh, Kingpin there because he does summon adds that taunt also. I don't even think the Nick Fury minions are really... The only thing that they're worth in this are basically once they die, she heals somebody. Oh! Not nice at all. Well, Minerva, I need you to... There you go. Bring her back. Thank you. And just, wow, look at all these. So we're up to six. So basically, this is everyone that's going to be left here. Maybe I'll get rid of Deadpool just because he's got the biggest uh, threat here. By threat, like the biggest one, I mean, I mean, he does like his big, I'm just going to one shot the uh, lowest person. And he's gone. I should be able to with uh, some RNG. Basically, when she does, she'll do her heal and bring Shiri back. There it is. And Shiri's back alive. So let's see if we can get rid of some of these uh, taunters. I would like to get rid of Black Widow, but apparently it's not. Oh, there we go. Let's get rid of Black Widow. Uh, Kingpin, you're so annoying. <laughs> Alright, so after Kingpin's, after these guys are down, I think I'll actually get rid of Kingpin just because. Let's get rid of the damage dealer. He's got lots of charges too, so. Although, even though he does have some bleeds and his offense is down, he can still do a pretty decent amount of damage. Alright, we're almost there. Alright guys, so that's basically how you 3-star uh, tier 11 on the medical supply run challenge. I hope you found that helpful. Uh, if you did, please hit the subscribe button on the left. And check out one of my other videos on the right. Please leave a comment below if you actually came up with any other uh, combinations. Or if you actually have done the tier 12 uh, and have a suggestion for it, I will give it a try.